Hey football fans! Welcome back to Football News Center, your go-to source for all the latest updates in the world of football. Today, we've got some exciting news straight from Mauricio Pochettino's press conference ahead of Chelsea's match against Wolves. Let's dive right in, first up, Pochettino confirmed that Levi Colwell might not be available for the upcoming match, but they will assess him again on Saturday. He also mentioned that they are waiting for permission from the medical team to bring Trevor Chalabar back in. And Nicholas Jackson needs to be carefully assessed after his Afghan return. Now, let's talk about Armando Broja. Pochettino believes that his lone move to Fulham is a great opportunity for him to get more playing time. He hopes that Broja can make the most of this chance and shine on the field. Good luck, Armando! Moving on to the 4-1 defeat against Liverpool, Pochettino didn't want to dwell on the decisions made by the officials. He admitted that the performance wasn't up to par, but is determined to defend his club and its interests. Pochettino mentioned that luck wasn't on their side in that game, and it's important to accept that and move forward. Speaking of the penalty incidents, Pochettino expressed his frustration but chose not to complain. He highlighted the inconsistency in decision-making and found it difficult to understand. But hey, that's football, right? When asked if the defeat was a reality check, Pochettino acknowledged Liverpool's dominance and their deserving place at the top. He emphasized the need for improvement as a team and learning from the experience. It's not just about working harder, but also approaching the game differently and showing more maturity. Pochettino also addressed Cole Palmer's performance, stating that he can't be in a bubble when things aren't going well. He acknowledged that Palmer wasn't at his best, but also took responsibility for the team's overall performance. Now, let's talk about Christopher Nkunku. Pochettino hopes that he can handle the demands of the game and play more than just 45 minutes. They are working with him to develop his skills, and Pochettino is impressed with Nkunku's goal-scoring ability and overall quality. Keep an eye on him, folks. Lastly, Pochettino mentioned that Nicholas Jackson is aware of the need to stay disciplined and avoid a two-game ban. He's motivated to play after not getting much game time during the last month and is excited to be back with the team. That's all for today's update from Mauricio Pochettino's press conference. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more exciting football news. Thanks for watching Football News Center, where the game never stops.